ears that it off. Hey, hey, hey. I am the man who can just look at the woman and she gets pregnant. Where did you train from? You should leave issues of the generals to the generals. You want another rap? Yeah, Susan! <laughs> <laughs> when police picked camp at Harris de Sinasana, the FDC's women's league leader Ingrid Trinawe could not take any chance. At the slightest slumber like this, the woman could take off. The so-called daring woman utilizes all chances of escape when she sees the men in the blue. She even at times expresses her cause for concern at coming face to face with the men of the law. Don't touch me, sir. Don't touch me. You want to rape me? You want to rape me? But it was a week ago. When the whole world witnessed why Ingrid fears policemen. It is Friday, the 27th day of April. It is past 9 p.m. And in our Point Blank studios tonight, we have Barbara Almadi to give us a full account of what happened to Ingrid, the Iron Lady. Madame Almadi, you are live here on NTV Point Blank. Can you please tell us what happened to Ingrid on that fateful day? She was traveling to attend a 4GC pro-change rally when her vehicle was stopped by police officers. Uh-huh. Ingrid's car was surrounded by police officers and she was told that she was being arrested. So, what exactly happened, Madame Almadi? One of the officers sexually molested her in full view of the cameras. And point blank was there. Don't put me! <laughs> Ha! I can see they started with the legs. Please, you people! And then the breasts. You are moving me. What have I done? Hey! What? Leave my breast alone! Leave my breast alone! What? But the policeman was still not satisfied. Stop squeezing my breast! Stop squeezing my breast! Remove her from there! Do it! Third round. What have I done? Hey! What? <laughs> Lord Mayor, you were with Ingrid on that day. What is your comment on this? You squeeze the breast. Even after she cries out, you continue, you do it again. And it would appear even this policeman was relishing what he was doing. It, it was intentional. Lord Mayor, does it mean you many relish in women's breasts? Why do you say that he was relishing in this kind of squeezing? Ingrid persistently was repulsing this man. Get off my breast. But this man would bring his hand again. Why do you think he did it continuously despite Ingrid's pain, Lord Mayor? The man was massaging, was pulling the, the breast, was enjoying it, was relishing it. This is indecent assault. So bad indeed. Uh-huh. Ingrid, how are you feeling now, ma'am? The breasts are bringing blood because of the squeezing. So I'm in a lot of pain. So, Madam Almadi, what action are you now taking as women activists? Are the police telling us that instead of keeping law and order, they're being trained to pinch breasts? And if so? If it's breasts they want, that's... Show them. <laughs> that's okay. We're taking breasts. Afanda <laughs> Kaihura! Oh! Afanda oh! Kaihura! You better hide! It is a bubblistic week. And the publishers ladies are confronting your offices now, right now. It is impossible to tame them now. But ah, ladies, take care of your naked breasts. I can see the Uganda breast squeezing force peeping through the windows. They seem to be saying, I wish I found the sense me to arrest that Kayanga one. She is really bubblicious. We are bringing our breasts to be pressed. Yes, you want to print breasts? We want to see how many breasts we are My God, though, never dare touch a woman's breast if you are not her husband. How dare you? Do you have a mother? You do you have a mother? How dare you? <laughs> you women, do you know what these hands are looking for now? Agnes Nandu too. Point blank. Why 
Why do you preach press? Why do you preach press? You want press or to keep Okay, be calm. Do you want calm, you're out of order. Ha, 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 ha,